if you're a local estate agent and you're looking uh, for more valuations um, pretty quick, then uh, I encourage you to watch the rest of this video. Uh, this is a video um, giving you a case study, uh, just being open and real with you lovely people about the um, about Google Ads, basically, and um, the importance of it. Now, um, simply because people are using Google every day. You've probably done it today yourself. So um, it's an opportunity, and thousands of people look for homes every day on Google even look for right moving portals and that sort of thing. We've all established that that's there. So I'm going to share with you some results, something that you might not already know about Google as well. It's because Google is more than these ads here that we all, you know, see at the top of Google when we do a Google search for anything. You might, you know, you might be looking for products, you might be looking for services, you might be looking for destinations, whatever it may be. There's four spaces at the top of Google. It's called pay per click. Um, on most Google's properties, especially on the pay per click model, you only pay for the click, you don't pay for the impression. So uh, we've got agents spending, um, you know, a couple of pound a day um, and, and not being able to spend the budget. So it's a very, very powerful thing. And you can also target within a very small local uh, level as well, i.e. one kilometer of your branch. You haven't got this restriction of, you know, 15 miles uh, from your area um, that you've got in other platforms. You've got, you can go down as low as really a mile or a kilometer um, of your branch or by postcode. So it's really, really powerful. And uh, let's get to it, shall we? So I um, want to share with you a little bit around Google. So obviously, we all know Google, um, obviously, from its um, from its pay-per-click advertising. You might not be aware also as well that um, it owns YouTube, uh, which is the sec second biggest search engine on the planet. Um, obviously, people use YouTube. A uh, common mistake that I see with agencies that they're using YouTube as a bit of a dumping ground for property tours. Um, big mistake. If you're going to change um, and get better results from YouTube, you want to use it as a, um, an educational platform. Um, so use it to educate the home seller, the home buyer, the first time buyer, first time seller, whatever it may be. Get your face on the camera. Um, you know, get over it, basically, uh, is, is what I always have to say. Um, you know, it's not all about, you know, whether you look silly or not. It's about your your content in your head. And um, if you can get your advice into someone else's uh, mind and be that giver, like Phil Spencer is here, he's the go-to guru in the, you know, the mind's eye, so to speak, from a, a layman's point of view. You know, I've just typed in here, how to sell my house in the UK. And uh, obviously, the, one of the first videos that we see is the Move IQ uh, channel, which, um, as we, you know, this will be an asset. Three years ago, we recorded this, and it's still going strong today. So it's unlike social media where you've got the feed within YouTube. Uh, if you're putting content and great content that's searchable, i.e., you know, it's giving information, it's giving content, it's giving value, it's not self-promotional, it's not come and sell your house for 0% fee and all that sort of jazz. You've got to be educational. Become the educational agent in your town and you will win. So Google owns YouTube. Google owns what is called the Google Display Network, which you know, back in its heyday, it was called AdSense. And when it was first, in, you know, accepted or whatever it's called, when it was first created, they went to every website on the planet and basically offered ad space. And uh, essentially, it's Google. Uh, it's it's a network now of over 2 million websites, including the Birmingham Life magazine. A display ad, Google display ad. Uh, it's for a school, so it might, could well be, to be fair. Uh, they're remarketing. Here's one here from Lead Pages, um, which is a web developer, web building software. Uh, they're remarketing to me. Um, we're a client of theirs, but they're getting me to, you know, remarketing to me to try and get me to up buy, uh, ups, upsell me. Um, this is uh, the standard. So it's, and the great thing is these ads are free to appear. You don't pay for it. You only pay for the click. So that's an ad there. So obviously you can see it's very dynamic depending on the, the, the browser type and the, size of the device that you're using and that sort of thing. So, yeah. Um, but again, you don't pay for the impression. You're not paying for the view. You're paying for the click. So if I don't click, they don't pay for anything, which is really, really good. So, um, yeah, YouTube, Google Display Network. You've got Gmail uh, and all that sort of jazz. So you got uh, you can get in front of people in their email boxes, which is pretty, pretty cool. So I'm going to share with you some results now. So here we are. So just to be fully transparent with you, um, first to the – 30th of Je uh, December uh, 2023, not in, quite in January 2024 yet. So this agent here is running um, Google Ads, 20 quid a day. Uh, we generated 15 
um, valuation opportunities. Okay, uh, 15 opportunities. We spent a grand total of 138 quid uh, in Google search. We spent a bit more on YouTube and so on and so forth as well. So um, just advertising properties on YouTube, which is really, really powerful. But this is um, a very, very simple funnel. Someone types in, they're looking to get their house valued. Uh, we show them an ad. Uh, they click on the ad, they fill out their information, and this page is converting at 42%. So 42%. So we've given Google, or the agent's given Google, 140 quid, 138.94. Um, and it's given the agent 15 families that are thinking about selling in their postcode, not 15 miles away or 20 miles away or even across the county, but very, very powerful. Hope you enjoyed this little case study. Um, yeah, any questions, drop in below and I'll... Speak to you very soon. Take care.